Renault's new 163bhp 1.6 liter turbo petrol engine has been fitted to the brand's Cadre crossover, but is it a perfect match? Verdict While the Renault Cadre is no longer our top pick in a competitive crossover class, it's still a fantastic family car. It's practical, comfortable and refined, it drives well and offers loads of standard equipment. For most, though, the more economical diesels or the cheaper its 130 turbo will be a better bet, offering almost all the performance and superior value for money. Two years ago, the Renault Cadre was our favorite midsize SUV. Since then, however, it's been surpassed by a host of rivals including the Citca and Peugeot 3008. That's not to say the French crossover isn't still a fine family car, it's just that the segment has stepped up a notch. To broaden the Cadre's appeal and bring it back to the forefront, Renault has added a new 163bhp 1.6-liter turbo petrol engine to the range. It's available on all models apart from the entry-level Expression Plus and is the exact same unit found in the updated Nissan Qashqai. Best crossovers on sale right now. On paper, it offers competitive numbers, both in terms of performance and running costs. It'll do 0 to 62 miles per hour in a respectable 9.2 seconds, return 45.6 miles per gallon and emit only 139 gram/km of CO2. In top spec signature S Naptrim, it undercuts the automatic only but identically powered 3008 GT line by almost 3000 pounds. On the road, however, it's a different story. If you're used to driving a diesel SUV, you'll miss the punchy torque delivery and low-end shove. The Cadrets needs to be worked hard to extract all that performance, and in gear acceleration feels inferior to the less powerful diesel 130, too. Having to work it so much harder means you'll spend more time in the upper reaches of the rev band as well. It isn't the most tuneful engine, either, so you'll find yourself doing all you can to drive more sedately. It's a shame. Really, because the Cadre is still a smart handling SUV. It'll hold its own in the bends, and while it isn't as sharp as Enca, the softer ride means it's far more comfortable on longer motorway journeys. At a cruise, the petrol engine is suitably hushed, though that cushioned ride was hampered slightly by our test car's 19-inch wheels. Speaking of which, you can't argue with the Cadre's kit list. Most will find the cheaper Dynamic Nav model offers all the equipment you'd either want or need, but if a Swish SUV is top of your wish list, this car's parking camera, leather upholstery and panoramic roof should tick all the right boxes. Key Specs Model, Renault Cadre 1.6-165 Signature S Nav, Price, £26,415, Engine, 1.6-liter 4-sil turbo petrol, Power slash torque, 163 bhp slash 240 newton meters, 0 to 62 miles per hour, 9.2 seconds, top speed, 127 miles per hour, economy, CO2, 45.6 miles per gallon slash 139 grams slash km, on sale, now.